I'm Neil Clemens. I uh, have a home wood shop in the Chicago area and have been woodworking for since I was young, very young, so 30 years plus. And my work is mostly hobbyist related, uh, home improvement, uh, making furniture, making toys, jewelry boxes, picture frames. I uh, do it for my family. It's great to give a handmade gift. I've got a full wood shop of, uh, of tools and I had looked at CNC. I had looked at, uh, and the problem with that I was seeing with CNC was one was space because the large machines take up a lot of space and I've got a small wood shop. But the other was complexity and really looking for something Thing that uh, you could start a project you need to cut uh, a pattern out or a circle or an arch and origin enables you to do that very quickly versus take the piece move it to a fixed device go out and design something so I really appreciated the space consideration of origin as well as the simplicity of origin I tend to start on a laptop and I'll get things close and then I'll come down here so this is a luggage rack um, it's actually a, a design I received as a gift uh, when we were married. And it's, this is, I actually drew one of the legs in. Uh, this is Fusion uh, from Autodesk. I drew one leg in Fusion and then replicated that leg, created the cross uh, braces and the center uh, connecting post. Very simple piece. If I want to export that to Origin, I can pick the leg and then come up to the Shaper plug-in and say I want to export a face, say OK, and I'll name that leg, save that, and now if I open that leg on my desktop, that's the leg that I can then import via Wi-Fi into Origin and cut that profile directly on Tool. When I was making the project, I cut a, a sample piece out of pine. The eventual project's going to be made out of sapelli. And I cut one just to kind of see how the profile was going to look. It was a little thin. Uh, this was about uh, eight tenths of an inch and I wanted to come up, uh, make this a little bit beefier. This is one of four legs that will end up making the, um, the luggage rack. So um, what I did is I went back to Fusion and changed one dimension, re-exported the leg, picked it up on Wi-Fi via Origin, and I immediately have the updated uh, tool path uh, and design in Origin ready to cut. One of the things about woodworking, it's easy to cut straight. It's hard to cut at a curve. And I think Origins, or your real strength, is in enabling new designs, new capabilities, and bring those to your work. I do a lot of furniture and things with arches. I want to do a lot more inlay. Uh, and a tool like Origin is really, I think, great for those kinds of capabilities, uh, both for making patterns that you can then use uh, in your furniture design as well as for cutting finished pieces. So. so we've cut the leg. Now we need to prepare a work holding jig to allow us to cut the tenon on the end. So what I've done is I've gone back into Fusion and I've created this pattern here. I'm going to extrude that out to be three quarters of an inch. And now I will export this with this face and I'll call that template for tenon. And if I open that up, that now is this shape that I will upload to the tool. So if I come over here and go to my hub within the uh, project I'm working on, which is the luggage rack, there's the template that I can upload in there. And then I'll download that to the tool and we'll cut that. So that lets us cut that. Isn't that cool? That's really cool. What I think, what Origin has enabled, literally in 15 minutes, I've made a, a change to the design and my workflow and Origin really accommodates that simplicity. Mm -hmm.